everyone and welcome back to me the Joanna Space Activist. Today I'm going to be telling you what is thermal inertia. So let's get right into it. Now you probably know that thermal inertia is two words, thermal and inertia. Now I'm going to have to break this down into the two words. So first I'm going to talk about inertia. Now inertia is the tendency in something to resist change. For example, a heavy bowling ball. It's hard to lift up, but once it's falling down the lane, you can't stop it unless you apply a huge force onto it. Now, that's inertia because, because the ball is hard to stop, we say it has a high inertia. Now, thermal is basically temperature. It refers to temperature. Now, if you put together thermal inertia, thermal inertia is the tendency to res resist change in temperature. Makes sense, right? So, let's think of a beach. Water, because w once the water heats up, it takes some time to cool back down again. We say that, that it has a high inertia. But, let's say, sand. You can, as soon as, let's say, the heat comes up and when it, once it cools down, the sand can do that pretty quickly. So, we say it has a low inertia. And, have you ever seen that snakes just lie on the road at night, it's because night is colder. So they hide under rocks um, at daytime and then they just lie on the road at night time. This is because you still have the heat and the, the road has a high inertia. So you still have the heat from the daytime. So that's how snakes actually keep their temperature during the night time. And it has a big reference to thermal inertia. And it's a perfect, perfect example for me, to, for me to tell you about. Now, this is all related to Mission Azaris Rex and Asteroid Benno. If you want to know more about that, you can check out the links at the end of the video. But um, planetary scientists who study Asteroid Benno and other planets, they have to use the thermal inertia to find a landing site, a correct landing site, because if they're gonna find the dust, they need to know where to find the dust and temperature also comes in. So, hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to leave a like, comment and subscribe. And thanks for watching.